This is in Saint Louis, one of the custom rooms, which was so good, outstanding at once. But it's been a long time since the last update. I tried this custom room in 2025 after a long time just to see if something is unique in this one, which is not even present with Android 15 or Android 14 based custom rooms. We will have a quick look at all of those things in this video, so stay tuned. First of all, I just found that we have ancient OS or ancient UI style clock styles in the quick settings panel. There are a lot of options available for you to customize the quick settings clock as you can see. Like some of the quick setting clock styles are present with Android 15 based custom rooms. Those are part of Iconify Magic module. But in this case, we have the option for customizing the more clock styles. And you can even customize them further. So that's something really amazing. For example, if you want to choose Oxygen OS style clock style, you, you, wanna you want to change the colors, you want to change something else, you can do so. There are a lot of options available for you to customize and do a lot of things. Horizontal and of course, some more things related to that. As you can see, customize whatever you want to. Another thing is related to status bar styles. We have the iOS style or you can say dual status bar or normal one if it is not working for you. Like in my case, if it is not working, what this does is you just have to restart your system UI once. As you can see, after applying anything, nothing working, click on advanced system, re system UI restart. And let me show you. Yes, it is working fine now. As you can see, we have just enabled the iOS KW super status bar style, something like that. It's almost similar to iOS. And now you have the option to choose the dual status bar. Let me show you. That's a part of this custom room. As you can see, we have the option available now. It is showing as dual status bar. Also, the clock, the date and some more things. Things are so good. Also, one more thing is related to battery customizations. There are a lot of options and tweaks available for you. You can customize the margin, left, right, top, etc, etc. I mean, almost every customization, whatever you can simply imagine, is almost present in this custom room in the terms of customizations. Things are just so good. You cannot miss them at all. We have battery related tweaks. There are a lot of options available. Some of the battery icons, some of the battery icon shapes are already a part of some custom rooms, but not all. So that is the thing which you can find out. As you can see, you can customize a lot of things, battery image rotation and some more things. This is all about the customizations which are present with Incentivist. Nothing more like that. If you need customizations, you might need this thing. If you don't want customizations, you can simply skip this thing on your device. For example, you also have the options or customizations related to theming. So for example, we have the option for settings UI customization which is one of my favorite feature personally speaking. Click on theme section. We have the option for settings base, which is one UI style and also this style. One more thing is let me show you if you, choose, if you choose this one UI style, you will notice that ancient features has this one UI style UI available. It's just all about customization. That's not about features by the way. Also one more thing is you can see you can customize the ancient features hub where you have all the customizations available, how you do customizations and something like that. Ancient OS theme, craft with heart, etc, etc. A lot more things to customize. One more thing is you have the about phone style customization. So for example, I just enabled this. This is Oxygen OS style about phone UI. I personally love this thing a lot. Whenever I use Ancient OS, I use this feature especially. You also have the option to choose the Oxygen OS style UI in the settings app. So it looks like it gives you the vibes of like you're using an Oxygen OS custom room or Oxygen OS software, depends upon which device you are using. This seems so good. Some of the things are, uh, some of the customizations are just not good or not useful, but some of them are actually so good. So it's already, it, it all depends upon you, how you think about it. If you love this thing, you can. If you don't, if you can simply skip this thing, it's totally up to you. Some of the other options, like you have the option for settings, homepage, theme, customizations, as I just told you, I always use Oxygen OS on my device. Talking about some of the other things in the terms of theming, for example, icon pack customizations. For example, as you can see, status bar icon customizations are here. We have the option for icon pack. We have the option for UI styles as expectedly. Like it's not like some of the customizations are unique or those are not present in other custom rooms. That is already part of this one. But some basic customizations like icon pack themes, those are not compromised too. So things are working fine in this case. 
we have the option for some other things like switches dialog corner style and so on quick settings panel has some options related to quick settings panel background custom which personally speaking it sometimes work fine sometimes it doesn't as you can see this is how it is looking like and yes one thing is perfectly right that more customizations is equal to more bug not every time it is right i mean sometimes you get some bugs but not the major ones because there are a lot of customizations so sometimes you did something else something else happened so these things usually happen in the terms of bugs yes there are some bugs with the instant os if you have ever used it but that's completely fine i mean if you have all the customizations you might face some bugs the bugs should not be the major ones if the bugs are minor then it's okay but if the bugs are major then you cannot use that custom room in my case i used instant os on uh, several devices i used that on mi 11x i used that on poco f5 i also used that with redmi note 10 pro also with redmi note 8 and many other devices too the experience was not that bad in some devices the performance and the customizations and the experience was just so good and in some of the devices the experience wasn't that good so it is what it is having some of the options related to lock screen this is one of my favorite features personally speaking lock screen has some options for example we have the analog style lock screen clock we have the option for customizing it further so that's one of my favorite feature too some of the clock styles are not even present with many many custom rooms yet as you can see we have the ancient west lock screen clock style we have the option for analog clock style you can make it you can make it look better further of course a lot of things are available so if you take a look at all the customizations you can see you cannot customize everything or you cannot skip anything there are a lot of things available for you to customize and use it on your device so yes these are the things available with this customization section and some more things as far as i know if you take a look at all the customizations the video will be so long taking a look at some of the other things like some great options for example enabling or disabling the google play services that is so, so useful unfortunately it's not present with android 14 or android 15 based custom rooms yet another thing is related to parallel space that's also so useful what this does is you can create multiple instances of any particular android app and multiple which means i guess you have the option for five up to five multiple instances you can use also some options related to spoofing are also present you have the option for google camera spoofing unlimited photo storage low signature spoofing higher fps in games and a lot more extra things in the terms of spoofing so as far as i know most of the features are already available already working so that's good you can still use it on a device if your device does support instant os android 13 last update was android 13 as far as i know and if it is available for your device you can still give it a try maybe it is working fine for you if you need more customizations like some of the custom rooms are not able to provide you all the customizations if you still need them you can try out instant os on a device at least once for sure three finger gestures hide ime button space the basic features are also present so sometimes in some custom rooms like you have all the major customizations things covered but the basic customizations does not work so in this case it's not like that it is working fine so that's good so yes these are things available in this case the default launcher as expectedly as expectedly it's a different one it is having some options and tweaks like the basic options and customizations one thing which was expected that circle to search yes it is not working if you're looking forward to some other things like circle to search it is not working as i just told you but uh, like play integrity which is also one of the major concerns and things as expectedly it's not there it's not working so we have to fix it on your own by installing modules and so on so yes this was all about today's video if you like this one make sure to drop a like if you are new here don't forget to subscribe the channel we'll see you in the next one until then take care